Hi Kappers, it's Sean Zad Kapagai. Welcome back to my channel. Do subscribe and become a part of the notification Kappa gang. Now let's get into today's cappuccino when I'm dying. So, okay. Oh, bougie, bougie, bougie. Mugai has released a statement and I just can't wait to read it for you. And then we talk about everything that's wrong with the statement. Let's go. He said allegations for GBV against Bougie Bigwa. Dear all, I've been through the most rough emotional and difficult time the past few days regarding allegations against me of GPV. In no way do I condone such behavior and actions that occurred on the night. However, I feel victimized as I was not allowed and given the opportunity to relay my side of the story. After the incident took place, I tried to reach out to the said complaint in many ways available to me, but with no success. I then spoke to my management team and advised them about what had transpired on Tuesday evening and what I had tried to achieve in resolving the matter before the necessity of taking further actions. I have been accused of GPV which in no way sits well with me as I have been labelled as an abuser which I am not and it saddens me to see how this has spiralled out with people believing and siding with one side of a story. I was verbally abused and told that my surname has no relation to who I am and because of that, that is why my career is not going anywhere in terms of growth. In fact, what is it that I do in the media industry because I'm actually nothing is what was said. Furthermore, during a verbal confrontation, I was then physically assaulted, being kicked and punched while being told that I am a man, I am a man, I must take it. The pain and suffering of having to let a woman abuse me verbally and physically while trying to complain to contain myself and holding her hands to stop was not enough until witnesses managed to defuse the situation. That did not make matters subtle as it was continued that I was insulted with a glass in my hand, I unintentionally threw it out of frustration. Without any intention to cause physical harm, I do however acknowledge that matters could have been handled in a different way and I sincerely do apologize for how it ended. With that being said, I also opened a case of common assault against the culprit for physically attacking me. And after being in pain from the injuries I sustained for seven days being held in police custody, I have received medical attention and have filed by medical records towards my counter case. I do trust and believe that justice will be fairly saved and ask that speculations be just that as the matter is being handled by law enforcement and further investigations are still underway. During this difficult time, I request space and respect on the matter and will reserve further comment on this platform. Bougie. Now guys, first of all, Bougie is not justified at all. And right, it sounds like he's low-key trying to excuse his actions and justify by saying he was provoked and don't don't which maybe he was provoked, I can give him that. Um, but then him justifying everything, that's gonna make things worse for him, especially with the whole audio out. For example, he says him throwing a glass was unintentional, yet he can be heard saying he'll basically get famous by messing Boiti up. And shortly after we hear a glass being smashed and we assume it was smashed against Upoiti because these are the results here on the picture. Aki sure about this whole statement thing. Aki sure he should have just kept quiet because right now it's making everything worse in my personal opinion. His team should have seen this actually. Whoever is responsible for his PR should have just seen this. They are definitely letting him down because right now Nothing can justify his actions, not even alcohol or being provoked, you understand? So I don't feel like it was justified. But anyway, what do you all think of this statement? Tell me in the comments down below. For me, I don't see this ending well for Upuji. That's just my own opinion. Side note, can you guys just subscribe and share my videos? And it really helps me a lot and motivates me. I've gone from 43,000 subscribers, you guys, to this. And it has really demotivated me. But I'm really trying to push for you guys so can you just please just help a brother out and show support for what i put out 
from me that kappa guy i love you and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next one bye